Hey everyone, this is Ross. In today's video, we're gonna give you guys a nice little PSA. Now is the last call to be pinching our figs. And the reason why it's the last call, if you think about it, from about this point here, let's say, let's take this fig as an example, the one where my finger is. From that point until ripe is about, let's say 85 days. I can't even say 90 days. When these figs form, it takes at least 90 days for them to be ripe. So if we fast forward in time, today is July 1st, 90 days from today, when we'll actually have a ripe fig is October 1st. And October 1st here in my climate, I don't know about you guys, but October 1st really just isn't the greatest weather to be ripening figs. Uh, it's too cold. We're really getting into the fall. It's probably a bit rainy at that point. Um, so what I'm doing here in my climate is to really prepare them and to squeeze out every little last fruit. I'm going around every single tree that I have, whether it's in the ground, in a pot, I am making sure that I'm taking off those tips. And, and how does this work exactly? Well, we did a lot of videos on pinching. We actually did a whole two hour live stream talking about the exact specifics in detail of how this really works. But essentially by taking off the tip here, guys, you are removing that auxin. On every tree, at the very top of the tree is the most auxin. On all the growth points, that's the auxin. You take that off, you remove that auxin, the tree is now gonna send its energy to other places on the tree. It's gonna send its sugars into other places on the tree. So that's really what we're, we're doing here when we talk about this, is that now by taking off the tip, the energy is then gonna be focused into forming these new fruits. And it's actually going to accelerate this process. So we could, in fact, just let this grow. It would eventually form fruits. But if we wanted really early fruits, like in a warm climate, you know, not necessarily in my climate, but there's a big lull, there's a big pause between the Brabas and the main crop in a place like California, in a place like Arizona. So this is a really nice technique to remove the apical bud get ourselves earlier fruits that will form somewhere between the Brabas and what would be our regular timing of the main crop. Not only does this do this here in our climate, it does it everywhere, but this is also a good idea for you guys living in a longer season. At some point in your season, it's gonna be over. So you need to think about this 90 days ahead of time. And instead of just trying some voodoo magic, trying to come in here and do some kind of rain dance to ripen these figs, you know, putting on olive oil as an example, it can work, but why not do this now? Why not think about this ahead of time? Prevent the disease. Why not wait? Why wait until you have the disease to do something about it? It just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. So for me, that's what we're doing today is we're coming in here. We're preventing that disease. We're at a bar. It's closing. It's the last call for a drink, now is, now is the time for the last call for our figs. If I don't see them now on the tree at this point, we just ain't getting them. It's just plain and simple. So that's my PSA for you guys is to come out here, you know, make sure you look at every individual tree very closely. We just did this on a couple of these limbs over here. We took off the tip. You can see that sap flow coming out. And that's all it is. Here's another example right over here look at the uh, look at the where the leaf stem you can see the leaf stem right here where that attaches to the main branch look right above that you should see two buds if you don't see two buds you're not going to get fruit but i don't want to hear anybody coming to me a few months from now when their trees are dormant and saying ross i didn't get any fruit all my figs had formed but they never ripened why is that well because you guys didn't watch this video and that's the video that i'm going to link them is say hey 90 days before you wanted your figs that's when you should have pinched so all right everyone thank you so much for watching this one i really appreciate all the support i really do like that you guys have been watching all the videos on pinching hopefully there's a lot more people that understand this technique there's been a lot of videos from other content creators that have been putting in the putting out videos on this topic and I can honestly say that not all of it's completely accurate. So if you want the truth, you want the real honest truth, all the little details, all the videos that we've done on pinching, we have a whole playlist 
dedicated just to pinching. We have probably, I would say maybe even close to 15 videos just on pinching that we've done over the last three years. So check that out guys. I'm going to put that down in the description and uh, we'll catch y'all soon. All right. Take care everyone. Thank you again for watching and we'll see y'all for tomorrow's video. Take care.